Hey, what's going on everyone? It's the boy Alter Tech back again with a new video. In today's video, we have the OnePlus 7 Pro with the new update. This is Android 10 open beta version number two, right there, two. So what does this update actually bring? It brings a ton of things and it's basically just bug fixes. So number one, let's go ahead and read it down real quick. So for me, um, the only bug I've had to deal with was with the camera app. For some reason, it was just not responsive when you're in landscape mode so i would have to switch it to portrait mode like so and then the buttons would be responsive once again so anyways uh since i've had this update um that issue has not surfaced so let's go ahead and see what else we have over here number one the system you've optimized the animation effect when notification bar is being scrolled upwards so you're optimizing it this is the navigation notification bar so I guess it's a lot more smoother. That could be it, or I could be wrong. Number two, you redesigned the Wi-Fi icon and the quick settings. Now it looks to be exactly the same, but once your Wi-Fi signal starts to drop, uh, there will be a new animation. So I've yet to have my Wi-Fi signal drop. So uh, it is what it is. Anyway, so you fixed the crash issue with the fingerprint lock. You fixed the crash issue with the default OnePlus gestures. You fix the issues with the status bar not displaying UI elements. And you fix the dark screen issue on the lock screen while accessing games. And you fix the crash issue with system UI caused by parallel WhatsApp app. And there's general bug fixes and stability improvements. So for everything else over here, I have not encountered any of these things. But now with this update, um, it's guaranteed that I'm not going to have to deal with those issues if, it, if they were to happen. But uh, anything else, um, you know, the fingerprint sensor... Like I said, it's just pretty damn good. It's one. It's so good, you know, you forget that you're using a fingerprint sensor built into the screen, which is exactly what I wanted from the first gen fingerprint sensors. But these are the second gen models. So, so far, everything is working pretty damn good. Like, uh, with this is Nexus 6P, this fingerprint sensor is built into the back. So, it's almost, it's almost the same performance. I, I barely see any differences or notice any differences. But um, anyways, uh, that's the open beta 2 update version. If you guys have any questions or comments, please hit me up. And if you have any issues with your OnePlus open beta version 1 or version 2, uh, let me know as well. I will be doing a battery test on this to see how the battery actually works. And so far, yeah, I'm at 69%. It's working pretty damn good. Uh, there isn't any battery drainage. So let me see how I've been using it. So about 16 hours ago, you know. It's working pretty good. It might even be an improvement. So, um, if it keeps it up, if it, if it keeps it up at this pace. So, anyways, it's Alter Tech signing out. Hope you guys have a great and wonderful day. Peace.